Hello anyone who may be watching now later on YouTube, hit in here along with Rajir. And welcome to Something Sunday where we'll be trying a few games to see if they are any fun. Perhaps to stream later as well in fully. Or just a one shot to have some fun and have some laughs. And today we're starting with Agent Clutch. Uh, yeah, anyone who's been following these videos might have noticed that I had been going through games chron alphabetically, not chronologically. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I decided to make a little fast track lane after, well, last week was not a disaster almost for most, well, for most of it. And uh, yeah, the <clears throat> I'll next week I'll try and uh, refine it a bit more that I do two games from the fast track and two from the alphabetical lane from my Steam library. Um. <clears throat> But I'll figure that out. So maybe I'll pick one from the, the fast lane of games I do want to try at some point, and one from the alphabetical line. I'll just have to figure that out. But for now, welcome to Agent Klutz. Uh, this is a fairly recent game, I believe. And it's a sort of a spoof slash parody of well, spy movies. And it's, well, a lot to. Uh, <laughs> I'll not give away the exact details of this yet. So let's let's see. The Heinz residence. Dr. John Heinz is said to be working for a Mr. A. Time to give his house a thorough search. Thorough search. Okay. And yeah, as is obvious, it, <laughs> this is a big pixel game. Very pixel. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> your page on Facebook. Come on. Uh, click to the beat. Wait, what? Yeah, this is a rhythm game. Oh no. I think I'm expecting a bit more comical game. Yeah, that was it. <laughs> okay, this is going to get some use to. Now I already expect you want to be playing script with the metal dancer. And if I if I click on the wrong beat, he falls over. Okay, wait for the laser. Got oh, too early. <laughs> okay. All right. And now I think I'm going to why I get pixelation at times. Why? Uh, in a corner, there's a red dot with an exclamation mark. Okay, so it's right on my end. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Trying to rush through this is obviously going to not pay. Okay, the music is advancing as we go through the... Okay, we can hide behind stuff. Okay... Are you ancient or are you a bitch? A what? 
Uh, I'm guessing both. <laughs> residence <laughs> C minus yeah. obviously this isn't a triple A game of course <laughs> it's <laughs> no casualties uh, it is empty now <laughs> Did we just steal some ladies back? <laughs> I think that uh, Agent Klaus here is just a kleptomaniac. accident that I actually managed to get that. Apparently, yeah. Okay, that, is that literally a camera with a gun? Like, an act, just a pistol? <laughs> the hell, the hell did we steal there? That was me clicking off screen. Someone, some glasses, come on. <laughs> You're not. I, yeah, the shields are probably there, so you can't shoot them in the back. And why the? Okay, why did we go? Oh. To steal everything, of course. It's, you are not going to turn around because you lack the number at the back of you. Come on! Oh. <laughs> to even unlock the Sam train. Yeah, I've made uh, E minus. Come on.
Okay, he's easy to convince. Judging by the fact that every other step he falls flat on his face, he is yeah not the <laughs> the sharpest knife in the toolbox. But yeah, yeah the shield is there so we can't shoot him in the back, I think. Yeah, I, I like it that. Yeah. Off screen again. Yeah. Can I sneak by this guy somehow? <laughs> the shield completely reflects the shot and kills you instead. Uh, yeah, I get the feeling we might be able to finish this game in this in this stream. I somewhat doubt that. Can we hide at one of these people here? Or do I just straight up have to f shoot this guy in the face? And yeah, nobody in the bar is uh, disturbed by the fact that there's someone with an assault rifle and a s shield on their back. Well, they all hold a machine with an arm, but they're holding the machine gun with one hand. Okay, I could hide there. But uh, I took too long. I'm hiding behind a fat guy. <laughs> Come on. Oh, rude. Oh. And the crowd is acting like doors. Come on. <laughs> Okay, just steal the cross straight straight from his face, okay. <laughs> Flashes, it's a bit harder to keep the beat. Like. Oh dear. And now I'm actually starting to question if you are able to do that, to finish it in one screen.
Yeah, I'm using my hand now as a sort of tick metronome. And I completely missed up there. So probably just kill the guy. Actually, I can. Sh okay, I can shoot from cover. That is going. Yeah, that, that is going to make things a lot easier. And not. I shouldn't stop. I should stop trying to. Uh, <clears throat> I should stop trying to uh, stealth this because we're playing this for fun. Yeah, and I feel like uh, the problem our men shoot them or something. Flash is still there a bit. Uh, the, the, the flashing is still in a, a, a minor key in the scenery here. hat from his face. Okay. <laughs> what are, are they stealing earrings from someone? Come on. Okay. Oh, at least it gave us a checkpoint now. Someone's bag. The hell is that supposed to be? Come on, just wait. <laughs> what the hell? What? Did you see a man again? I think he stole a, a guy's heart. <laughs> and the yeah, entire I, rest of him. <laughs> yeah, I owe him a really hard to see that actually. Text of torture, come on. Uh, yeah, this is just a dumb little game. Come on, <laughs> my new pal is going to give me some free drinks. <laughs> yeah, at gunpoint. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Uh, 
heck, that's professors. No. Okay, I thought I thought that was back one, but no, <laughs> it's a freaking wall. Well, it's an aquarium, so. Yeah. Big ass shark. Yeah, that was a sunfish. Oh, you actually skipped the portions for that? Okay. Oh, down here it also shows stuff, like it's, bas it's basically a map of the place, and where we are, of course. Really a, a golden goldfish, a golden goldfish <laughs> skeleton. Timing. Missed it. Wait. Are they out of sync? Oh no. Yeah, they are out. Okay. At least it doesn't kick us all the way back. Yeah, but that's somewhat. Like a bad game design. Achievement unlock Mr. Klotz, probably for falling down like 100 times or so. I've already fallen over that many times. Probably. Okay, now they are in sync. Or not. Of course, I get too hasty with clicking. Just stole an actual goldfish. What the hell? <laughs> and I think that was also an achievement for that. Let me take a quick look. <laughs> Not little Oscar <laughs> stole the fish. achievements a minus again yeah they want you to be real quick with these to get a high score Stairs. Okay, yeah, these things being out of sync is very annoying. Yeah, that just is like bad games on there. But it's really going to ruin the game entirely unless they are totally with those. going on downstairs.
and back. Just had to help close the door there. <coughs> Just had to help move the old washing machine out because it broke. Uh, well. Yeah, this afternoon will be. <coughs> we've already ordered a new one. <coughs> this is going to be hell on the left, on the left, <laughs> on the timer. But yeah, some metal part of it completely eroded away because it's made out of, it was made out of a non-water resistance material. And yeah, in a in a washing machine, you think that they use something that doesn't rust. Yeah. Okay, so I even have to <clears throat> I even have to pull out a gun on the rhythm. Yeah, I think it was like five years. Or if you if you misclick and try to click again on the next beat, then yeah, you're going to it's not going to register correctly. There seems to be a small pause between when clicks can register. I think. Right, this game this game just cost one or two bucks, so it's it's, it's no big crime or anything. Uh, yeah, I can't give it Come on, I made through the entire hallway. Are they just shooting on sight? Looks like it. Um, like I don't even get the way. chance to shoot back. Too early. Shoot instantly, okay. Probably because they are expecting me to be here, unlike the previous guards. Then how am I supposed to get past them? Oh wait, I... Previously, I've been catching them off guard by not walking into the line of sight for one. So if I walk straight into what they can see, they will, they can shoot instantly. Yeah, like there. But if they turn around to face me, then I catch them off guard enough to open fire. Might have been uh, nice if there was a small signifier of that, like uh, you telling us to remember. <sighs> remember, don't walk straight into their uh, in to face them or something. <sighs> yeah, out of sync lasers is always annoying because either you you have to wait for a perfect window to, for it to open.
Okay, those guys I can get the drop on by just walking in on them. Also works. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, you're being soft. Uh, yeah, it's really bad, guys. I can't understand, but yeah, he's been stealing from more than just bad guys so far. Yeah. But Plus, you don't have to click on the beat, but it, it throws you off a bit. Okay, there we go. Okay, one turns, one patrols. And the other guy just does not care. <laughs> Understand you, but next year you just died. But that's not one of them. It's just a simple game. <laughs> okay, I like that they actually put in a gate to the aquarium at there. <laughs> From here, you look like I had a 50 50 chance. Come on. <laughs> Smith. Okay. Stealing photos now. I half expect the one point him to steal a lollipop or a baby. <laughs> Okay, yeah, these guys are just shooting instantly on sight now. It's just a 60s stereotype or something, or something that's just stuck. Lollipops, but they can't 
legitimate. That's like very young kid. Me and my queen. They have a queen. It looked like candy. So my favorite overdose candy meaning he we didn't accept them, we also went for the fruit. Okay. <laughs> Again, we're, we're hiding behind the fat guy. I guess. A fat floating way. Is that a reference? Can't see. Big fat smoke. Oh, I have to think about it. I think it's not the truth that's been done so many times. That way. Yeah, I see those in many detective movies. They have that big overweight guy with a cigar. Yeah. There's always one of those in his old uh, shows. Yeah, but that's probably why that is one. Come on. Yeah, it's idiotic. And that's the level achievement. And actually, I think someone actually succeeded to run away with it, but again, his face wasn't on the camera, so they found him upon the shore in his bathtub. Almost then. Yeah. Because there's always, uh, yeah, fish need a lot more care than people think. Yeah, there are freshwater sharks, sure, but a bathtub, no, it's it's not enough. Yeah, for one, fish needs running water, or at least that water gets cleaned up. Why, are you, why do you even have a dress on a mannequin with you like this? <laughs> uh, what the heck? Yeah, it's just a, it's just a cheap, silly game. Yeah. But he did on fish. Okay, that this is going to get tricky. Do not use this door. Or that door. Okay. <laughs> I think we found a glitch. That or that's a spider? Alright, yeah, that's the right thing on Maniki. I first, first, when I saw the dress first, I was thinking, are you gonna see the dress for someone's body? That would probably be a bit too far. What the mm -hmm. I just happened to look out uh, towards my window and notice that it's snowing. 
Oké. Okay. Hallo. Oh, I think I see it. I see it now. The ones with the big guns, those shoot instantly. The ones with the small guns, uh, it takes a bit of time to get the shot on you. Yeah, Sam. You don't have the same aim pistol like the other the rifle. Turn around. There we go. No, with that pistol, a pistol really needs to aim too much with a pistol. Yeah. Uh, oh, come on. Uh, and if they are in out of sequence, at, uh, at least they're in sequence, it seems. Alright, that's good. Otherwise. Yeah, if they all were out of pink, then that's just be damn painful. Most likely becomes a rage game. Oh, and we have a guest star today, it seems. Inky? Yep. Hello, Inky. I can't see you, but I can still say hello. Yeah, apparently she wants attention because she just climbed up on the, the desk. <laughs> and she checked out the camera and ran off. Probably noticed that she's not on camera. And now she's on her usual spot on the desk. Or not. I still don't actually know a specific word for that, but she's over there. Right. I feel like here's the thing. I probably would have had a cat as a kid. It's not because I'm a kind of allergic to them. Okay. No, so, Robert, here's the thing. And this is a long ago. I guess I can have a cat and all that, fine. Problem is if I stay stay in a house with a cat for a week, then it may trigger. Okay, a family friend has something similar like that. Photo has been but for cats and dogs. They can still be around or just cat own one. Oh come on you idiots. <laughs> no, I jump at these opportunities. <laughs> Oh, come on, even sketch the map, come on. Even he needs to prize. Or I bring my gun, yep. Yeah. Or you can bring your gun. Why not both? Yeah, maybe he should be called Agent G for genocide. Yeah! Dang it. I think that's a deep meaning we dropped. That's true, or being violent as well. Cool. Yeah, why don't you get it to check out the meme later? Okay, two shield guys. And there's a security thing that needs to be shot. Yeah, it's kind of interesting with info for them. You have a team yet, used a lot, but it's actually meant to be a team to get someone that's not, not going to vote. So yeah, like well, yeah, you need something increase, like the uh, they had democracy there earlier on, you had you had votes and all that. So you had someone that did not want to vote, he became the village minion. This does make sense, but when it Oh <laughs> of course this uh, freaking lasers outside there. Okay, okay. that's that's poor game design. Again, is it two bucks? Yeah, it, it was cheap as all hell. I don't remember how much specifically, but uh, below ten at the least, below five probably. All right. And now you realize why the heck do you use the bring box? Uh, because that's 
typical slang in English, at least, or in American. Very American. I don't even use that. I don't think I'm going to use uh, any slang for money. Besides cash, obviously, but, but never as a, when I say a price, I usually say, yeah, KR or Euro or dollar. Oh, uh, yeah, I found it a bit funny you use the term uh, bucks. <laughs> uh, what, what else did you mean? Uh, it goes for one moose or one deer. <laughs> Thank you for the mental image. We think uh, it's about five moves. Uh... Okay, this is a bad point because I have absolutely no idea if the lasers are on or not. Yeah, and right as I say that, they, right as I go through, they jump, they spring to life. That's, that's very poor game design. Okay, yeah, there should be some it. sort of hint. You, you could probably count the, the, the time that it's on and off. Yeah, but still, that's... Even for a game, that's cheap. That's so offensive. Faux pas. Yeah, or maybe you can look for something or like just, just 20 euros or something like that, but now I feel like, uh, okay, we're gonna overlook that one. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And the seven is four. Uh, I should have continued counting. Seven, two, three, four, five. Okay, so it has a cycle of twelve about. Seven, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, twelve. Twelve, nine. Okay, now I've lost count. Let's give it one more shot. We are almost at an hour anyways. Yep. And I don't feel like we should be standing here in one hour just to try to get past that. Yeah, he just absolutely gave no fucks about his friend there. Oh, he has a big gun. Yeah. Did he at least get a checkpoint? I thought it put us back on the other side of the six uh, timed laser. Yeah, I'll put it back in my 
come back. Yes, people. I killed a glass person to get a call. Okay. I get the feeling that this is probably the last uh, level because this is going after that Mr. A that's supposedly in charge. Uh, and that is probably him then. The A estate achievement unlocked. Why the hell are you even making bombs? Come on, you idiot! Never about the bombs? Come on! <laughs> uh. I was expecting a twist. Yep, and because Klutz was an idiot, <laughs> all of those bombs went off. All over country. What the heck? And where the heck is this? Okay, five people. You finish it in 55 minutes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. You probably got on it faster if you didn't have uh, some issues. Yes, uh, still, I'd say that was uh, 55 minutes were well spent. Now, yeah. let's see. The other uh, game. Now I, can, hmm? now I can get the chance to finish it. That you got past that annoying part. Yeah. Uh, if they if they improved it, if they improve on what they uh, started with there, they could be a fun little, a fun little group to work from, uh, to uh, see in the games come from in the future. Now let's see. Yeah. Will it capture this game as well? There, there we go. And now to share it to you. Yes. Are you going to be difficult again, gamer? Switch it off full screen for a moment. There it is. Okay. Sharing to you now. Alright, it's loading. Then I turn it back ah, to I full screen. Ah, it's a ground. Yeah, this is a ground. This is, from what I've heard, this is basically. Uh, many people consider it a Terravia clone that looks worse, but from what I've seen, the its gameplay, it, its visuals are uh, simpler because there is more going on the background. Or yeah, not maybe not that, but um, I, I'm not sure how to say it at least. But from what I've heard, this is a satisfying game to play. And yeah, let's give it a shot. Uh, let's click random here a few times. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, let's go. Uh, let's go with Miss Bella m from Spower Puff Girls. Then. <laughs> oh, I was not the only one thinking that he uh, was going to go down. Yeah. I run. Make it, make it a bit Swedish word. Uh, 
Oh, I guess you could count a piece of flotsam as a boat. <laughs> so, the entire I need shelter, but there's nothing around but fallen branches. Okay, I. WASD. You can make a uh, shelter from fallen branches, depending on the size of course. Okay. I'm guessing it wants me to prefer using the arrow keys, actually. And Z for ex over ca carrying capacity. Okay. Makes sense. Before I sort of used WASD, I always used arrow keys for every game. Hello there. Yeah, it looks like this game is supposed to be played with the arrow keys. Let's see. And I can finish it with eight words. Yep. I guess the Israel was prepared to find it easier for... Well, they are, oh, they are very easy to spot on a keyboard. And you don't... Yeah, the Israel, the arrow keys are being... You are less likely to be to click uh, another wrong button. Yeah, and, and when you are playing with the arrow keys, you do have a lot more... Uh, act you have access to a lot more buttons that you could use for actions over here. It can still get very annoying depending on where they put those buttons to be used, but still. Yeah, and also depending on like, if you still need to use the mouse, you need to... Yeah, basically get very cramped. You have, you have the arrows there and you have your hand nearby the mouse. It's usually near the, those keyboards. Yeah. Um, so you need to reach a lot. I think it's just staring out the window from her sitting spot. <laughs> uh, speaking of the washing machine, uh, you, I shared those pictures to you. That <laughs> there was basically her looking forlorn at where her sitting spot used to be because Ink typically sat most of the time on top of the washing machine that broke and well got torn apart to try and find out what the hell was wrong with it. So yeah. <laughs> I had to fix up a new sitting spot on the dryer next to it, and she looked pretty content with that. Let's see. That's good. Not bad at all. I wonder who began building this structure and why they stopped. It looks pretty recent. Help, please. Shelter. Oh, God. Why did I voice him? Thank you, I owe you my life. I had all but given up hope. I was too tired and hungry to finish the shelter, but what do we do now? For now we stay warm and dry and... Okay, just keep all of that to yourself. <laughs> I was saying he looked like you until he did that, and I wanted to uh, take it back. He's not you at all. Just for that, I mean, I'll move my camera in there, uh, so people can get a better see. look. Uh, I'm not seeing the resemblance. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's looking a lot more colorful. Okay, we have day and night cycle up from the looks of it. <laughs> yeah. We really expect to be able to survive here. It's hopeless, man. Game over, man. Game over. <laughs> you really good at you know, you're good at building, right? What if we build something to store the resources and food we gather? Guess with eight wood and four berries I might be able to make a decent storage. But how do you use berries for in construction? Glue? Okay. I can understand if you it meant to be a storage house, then you should have food inside to the signify it's a storage house, but still it's a bad lock shit regardless. I can use A and D to walk around as well, and I can use a mouse. Okay, so we, you can do this with both uh, mouse and WASD yeah, and, and uh, control Z and the arrow keys like that. I'll, I'll just go with uh, mouse and like this. Yeah, and is it this green shade here lot for you? I'm not. I'm not seeing it. Oh, it's shaking like mad on my screen when you move around, like it's like it's lagging or something. Hmm. And can't say it on my end, no. Oh, 
skulle det just mean att jag inte har pratat om det recording. Okej, okay, quest log. Oh, before I forget, uh, yes, I, you meant to do that picture, so show me. I think you and me had the same air fryer. <laughs> Could be. But is that the same handle, same color, same shape? If your air fryer is a silver crest, then yeah, we probably have the same one. Okay. Let's. Okay, these each take different skill amounts of skill points to get some to upgrade it. So we can only really use weights here for now. Okay. Yo, oh, come on. <laughs> I can't kill the damn duck or a seagull, probably. Okay, it, the graphics are simple. Uh, but the animations in them are quite nice, like <laughs> the beehive hair just moving with every step. Come on. Yeah, I can't see that because of it's it's jumpy and it's extra pixelated due to the uh, bad internet for some reason. Okay. See, that's everything for the storehouse, and then we can just place it like this. Okay. Machine but unlocked infinite space. <laughs> okay. Mm. Move all buttons. Okay, Q to toggle start. The item start items will stay in your inventory when you hit mouth move all. Okay. Uh, oh, hello there. Uh, who are you? <laughs> uh, move all. Yes. The axe is staying in our inventory anyways, it seems. I've been underground, there's way more di to this place than meets the eye. Which is what I think applies to this game as well. Because I, from what I've heard, you, the uh, progression system goes on and on and on and on. Eventually you can even go into freaking space. Oh dear. Uh, oh wait, I just remember the name. Yeah, bro, is the English name for... Yeah, basically what they happened to them. They set a ground on the island. Okay, and now it's getting a bit like Mother Load as well, it seems. Builder added one wood. Okay, so they're going to automatically do stuff as well. Okay. Yeah, I think the, the NPCs will help you out with things. Another level up. 14 skill points. Okay, that, that's a lot more. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I think some YouTube small playlists, but not much. Hmm. But most of them seem that they like it, but there's something lacking. Yeah, there's still a story going on and all that, but even I agree that there was something about the game. But it is charming, but something. Like it, it, it like it must be missing something. Graphics perhaps? Because this is... This, this looks like it could be on a mobile game. This probably is also a mobile game somewhere. That sounds familiar. I would not be surprised if it started as a mobile game. But then again, there's no microtransaction as far as I know. Okay, carrying too much. So... Okay, we can just dig up anywhere and it won't disturb the plants above it. Move all. Yes, don't ask again. Okay. Uh, any quests? Wants to build a storehouse already completed. Repair hut also done. Okay, so we just dig down and see what we find. Yeah, then again, I remember most you have seen playing this, they never been full with it. I think I'm going to quit uh, playing it at the same spot. So I don't know if the game gets better or not. Deep and unlocked instant meat. <laughs> Come on. We still can't kill the seagull. Let's see if there's anything by the B. 
speech here. So we we plane can't dig through that. Which bit would make sense because otherwise we'd be flooding this place. Uh, yeah. More weights. Let's, let's see. Let's put one in there, just in case. Yeah, from what I hear, this is a game that takes a while, and okay, there's someone's been digging here already. Iron ore, okay. Could explain what many users would drop it, but it's maybe a little grindy for them to show. Yeah. Sure, a big arc and arc and those games, like Valheim, can also get grindy. But at least the grind can be fun if something happens or just be edited out. I guess the grind of this game is just so boring that they. they not feel motivated to continue. Could be, yeah. But, yeah, we have an hour to try this, and it, it might be too short, and maybe we'll pick this up some other times from now, every now and then. But this is just to try it. Yeah. And I'm not against this. Try to just make sense of the riddles of why it's not too heavily covered. I think the, uh, I think the, the smosh of the group. Oh, not smart stump. The stump group may have uh, not done a long play playthrough, but uh, I didn't watch them as of yet. Okay. At least the uh, gameplay of that, so maybe, maybe I should do that to see if there's some answers. Okay, I do like that the other NPCs are <clears throat> are passively collecting stuff as well, so yeah, we don't I have do. to go and get everything ourselves. Yeah, uh, that that's the thing I like. Oh, out of stamina. And oh. These things respawn quite quick. Now think about it. I hope I hope nope. Fork 2 we have some system like that. Okay, <laughs> just playing game over, not even a recheck. Alright. Okay, okay, we just can we can save it anytime at the hut and I would be worried if you had to restart from all the way back. Yeah. yeah that just... would explain why people did not want to play this game so much. Yeah, we can save at the hut probably at any time, and we just didn't, so that was my own fault. Oh wait, Eggs. we need to rebuild. Yeah, we didn't we didn't save, so yeah. Um, okay. So basically, after every quest, we save. Yeah, that's usually a good game rule, but on these games like this, you usually don't need to save in that manner. Okay, that's everything for the storehouse. And we didn't lose that much, like only a few minutes. Yeah, but still, that's still odd, actually. But most of our games, if you die, you respawn. At your bed or something like similar, like a bed, and you you still keep your stuff. The only time you don't keep your stuff is if you somehow crashed before the auto save. Okay, there we go. Oh, hello. A rusty axe. Yes, please. Uh, I'm guessing this is this. Okay, equipment, dominant hand. One, one, five, three. One, three. Okay, let's use that instead. In the meantime, like, yeah, we're probably supposed to find something underground now. What's the item? That's actually a dead oh. Okay, he actually collects from the world itself and not just randomly generates it. Okay. Now let's yeah. just go straight down and see what we find. 
Uh, yeah, be careful. There are monsters down there, if I remember right. Uh, like that over there. It was in spraying yeah, for like a few seconds. Yeah, and probably even worse, I think. And all the better to put some points into your evasion then. At least. <clears throat> yeah, what I was saying. Uh, Frosty Axe can be a very deadly weapon. Sure, it might easily break, but if you cut some with it, the rust can poison you. Yeah. And mm -hmm. yeah, it's still an axe, so it still have a bit of a weight behind it. Yeah, that was one of the maggots coming back. For now though, just deposit all of this. Actually move that as well, because we have a better weapon now. Hotkeys. Okay. Rest. Okay, so just resting here is also good for progressing the story when there's a new character around. So when I arrived here, I just started digging and didn't even realize there was a storm. <laughs> Talk going... Oh, the new washing machine has arrived. I'll probably get called down to help with that again. But I'm glad you're here. I was getting tired of eating dirt, and th there's nothing like a warm fire after a long day underground. I... Let me move this up here for a moment so you can both... So both of those can be seen. Do you think there are more survivors out there? Honestly, I'm surprised anyone survived that crash, but here we are, and maybe others survived too? And now you have a quest. How's the digging going? Maybe we should build a smelter to smelt them ores and butter bars. Let's see, okay. Four more coal for that. Oh yeah, and there's the coal. So, BRB. All right. Oh come on, on. and you're getting killed by boar now. Yeah, folks, if I could, I'd probably be, if it, when he went away to do a washing machine, if I could, I'd just sit by his computer and make sure he doesn't die on screen. But, yeah, there's a C between us. So, all I can do is report back to him what happened. Okay, the hell? A boar attacked you. <laughs> okay. It attacked and killed uh, attacked you just at the end of the room. Uh, okay, except... I, I actually hoped you would hear me, but then yeah, alright. Yeah, I was a full floor down, so no. 
Yeah, um, that's you. It's good to take off the headphones. I suspect you can't hear me. Or can you? Uh, can you hear me without headphones? Can you hear what? Can you hear me talk without headphones? Uh, no. Yeah, there are more reasons for it. If they attack you, as quick you remove them. So, uh, I spoke out to ask you were about to leave and you are attacked by boar. So, yeah, explain you could not hear me then. Even more. So, yeah, just horrible timing. <laughs> okay, at least we didn't lose much of anything. Okay, where are you, miner? Over there. Okay. Let's put that right next to the storehouse. Uh, after we get rid of this tree. For a moment of thought you'll kill the man. <laughs> okay. Metallurgy built the smelter. Smelter can turn raw ores. Let me put move the camera over here back again. Smelter can turn raw ores into bars. It requires fuel to melt them down, but luckily there is plenty of coal around to keep it running. Okay. Um. Let's put some into health just to be sure that we will have a bigger chance of surviving. I thought we had stuff on us, but apparently not. Okay. I kind of like to use a damn rock boulder as a door. Okay, we can make coal from wood. That makes sense. And we can make one iron bar. And fuel. Add that fuel. Is that, is that really how you make coal? Uh, you you can make charcoal from uh, wood. Not sure if it works as well. Uh, here is something I'm seeing though. If we add one log, we can get we get ten fuel. But coal is twenty. But it takes three logs to make one coal, so it's cheaper to just add wood. Um, it, it doesn't use fuel when it isn't working, so that's a good thing. Yeah, but that's, uh, why even use coal as a fuel if it's very used wood? Yeah, because you can yeah. dig up coal on its own. Uh, okay, yeah. Now this gave us a reason to... Okay, that deal, <laughs> that Rusty Axe deals a lot more damage yeah, to the trees. The it looks like it's... It looks like it's lagging or something on my screen. Okay, we can, we can already make steel. Okay, not going to complain about that. Just oh get no. some more coal. Oh no, damn you, Helium. Hmm? What? Oh, now I have a digger dig hole stuck in my head again. <laughs> okay, this thing does a lot of, quite a bit of damage. Don't forget the robots, it's a good song. But we use the certain herbs just to play dwarf game or something. Okay, steel. Quite a big jump to go straight to that. It goes a boar. Okay, move Wait, everything. Did that boar just get sort of camouflaged but with the boulder? I can't. We should make a deal with the farmer. Where is the farmer then? First off, though, saving. Okay, okay I can see people get oh. annoyed by that. That you need to go to your hut to save all the time. Hello there. Boy, am I glad to see you. Here I was thinking I was all alone, just one old man in an empty world. I still got some life in these old bones, and I reckon I could help you out. Farming's my thread, and we all need some good food to keep us going. How about we build a barn and get a farm up and running? Okay, some more wood. And there we go. <laughs> okay. 
Probably place this close by. Now we have a farm. Stop by on occasion to you know, pick up uh, growing crops. They will help restore your stamina. Here, take some bread to keep you going while it grows. Okay. In the meantime, we should probably just remove the. Wait. Uh, where? It won't let me chop. Wait. Oh, it moved. It moved the uh, rusty axe as well, and okay, that is a problem there now. <laughs> okay, at least at least they can't get underground like us. Still a bit of an annoyance that it lets you put away your your weapon. Yeah. Uh, wait, if there were doubles would control you on the ground, would that make them groundhogs? And true. Okay, where? Wait, where is? Did it break? Okay. It was rusty, and let's be honest. How do you repair a rusty axe, or why would you repair a rusty axe? But okay, it depends highly on how rusty it is. But if it's extremely rusty, you, you can't repair it really. Uh, anyways, let's get back to clearing this place out because this farmhouse won't do much good if there is no wheat field to grow with. Yeah. I wonder, is it able to pick between the bushes? It could be enough to keep some of the bushes around. So, I think you can. Oh. Yeah, I think we can put just the middle bush to pick up uh, a field uh, between them. Okay, get her all of that up. And I should probably eat some stuff before I die. Yeah. Wait, can you store them? Yeah, there, there's the stamina bar here. Can I? Okay. Um, how do I set up the farm? Did I break it somehow? Because uh, there. Let, let, let me be, where's what the building menu? Let's see, build farm. What was that compass-like thing there? even have a build menu of our own? If we don't, then that could explain why many don't cover it. If you can... that extremely easily break the game. Hmm. Kitchen... 10 wood, 10 coal, okay. Okay, and when... There we go. Now, I bet you Yannins are thinking of this. <coughs> this here is the end of the world, but I thought the same during World War III, and yet here we all are. The way I see is it, you know, we just got to make the best of the situation and be glad there's food to eat and company to share. How long will we have to live on this for godforsaken island? Who knows, but as long as there's life, there's hope, perhaps in time this island will be as good as home. We're yeah. more um, yeah, that is concerning, but I think this is in the far future then. Uh, yeah, it does look like we just plain can't build uh, the, f the, f the, the wheat separately. We could build it without sacrificing the bushes. Yeah, the, the bushes got destroyed there. Okay, these automatically generate. Oh, and it automatically generates wood as well. Okay. Uh, yeah, coal was asked. 
Maybe yeah, we can okay. demolish that farm later on. Yeah, but I feel... If you somehow already that easily grew the game, you cannot able to make a regular wind farm. Yeah, that, that's a, already a red sign, but it's not as popular as other survival games. Yeah, and it's only single player, to my knowledge. Oh, I... Wait, wait, please? Like, I make me question why it was on... It, maybe it was also on Stump's channel, but they are usually playing a game so they can be from two to mostly four people on. Well, let's see. Ten words, ten call. We have two more calls to go, okay. But yeah, if this is just a single player game, that might also be why for... Sure, I played Walk still play for many years until I got on PS at my PC and then my PS4. But as quick as you play that game with a person, it's so much more fun. Yeah. This is quite this is becoming quite the settlement already. Cook food as long as you have wood or coal to fuel it. Workshop to turn all those metals into bars. I can make one for five iron bars and five wood. Okay. Yeah, th this is progressing quite fast from uh, just a hut at on the flo floor. And uh, yeah, now already <laughs> getting to four workshops. Make a torch to help you, you see. You can't be response from a hut to a small settlement. However, I'm sure you can do it this fast. Okay, those maggots are quite dangerous. And our stamina is almost out. Okay. Saving completely restores our stamina. So that's useful, but we can't fight those maggots yet. Yeah, and uh, as you said, this is mostly in the air, if it doesn't true. And that could explain why you have to save by the hunt, and it doesn't have a cost to save feature, like regular survival games. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, let's upgrade our site. And by regular ops, I mean like, most of you seem to have a... Like every 10 or every 20 minutes, you automatically stay the map. For what you have done. This, this includes the Valheim and the uh, Ark. Yeah. However, however, on auto question 4, you can stay in a corner that is it's saving. You can't see that on PC. Okay. I don't know. But it, it is saving. Let's see, it, will this be enough metal? I do like that you can use everything from your storage and that you don't have to carry it around. And, and am I getting called again? Uh, thank you, but, uh, may want your today? I'm guessing it needs help to put the washing machine in its place. So you have to be the muscles. Okay, we have quite a bit of uh, <coughs> quite a bit of meat here, so I might as well create as many as possible. I should probably to buy meat like that from the Eastern Point. It takes ages like that. However, if I'm gonna buy meat like that, I'm gonna make sure I buy the ones without bone. I don't think you should put the bones into the air fryer. Yeah, personally, I really. Maybe it is just a, a luxury thing, but I do not like uh, meat with bones still in it. Yeah, I usually bought both of the time meat with bones for it was cheaper usually and usually on sale. But I usually find the bones to usually be more in the way. Mm. And yeah. More things to throw away. That's one of the reasons why I don't like f most fish because, yeah, it doesn't matter how m much uh, you try to clear f out of the bone, there's always one or two still in there. Yeah, and some fish is easy to do that with, like a big salmon, but then, then you can chop off 
Is dat niet met auto bonen Easy, easy, easier. Dat ik af. Maar, ja, men je moet de smaller fish. Dat is wel best probleem. Ja. Dan met de tip van die bonen, dat vind ik ja. En ik vind fish with more. Maar, ja, alles is wel een beetje bonen ding. En ik weet dat dat is annoying. Oh, hello. Een iron sword en iron armor. Yes, yes. <laughs> Okay, it, durability 200 of 200, so these weapons can break after time. Uh, <coughs> makes sense. Do a oh, all right. Depending on the armor, it you should it, the armor should be break apart too easily. Again, depending on the armor, you you is the focus thing, folks. You should always take good care of your armor to make sure it's in top performance. Okay, let's, can I actually... Yes, I can hurt these things now. But I'm low on stamina, so I should not. Oh dear. But yeah, that's also why there was mostly the knights had the most heaviest armor for... Yeah, they had the help to may help maintain their, all their horses and equipment. Oops. Oh, I see something here. The farmhouse has access to the orchard and would have had the wheat field as well. So we can we can probably place those as far away as we want to uh, and still have easy access to them. The rat was stolen from the. Okay, so we're going to have to do something about those rats. Uh, okay, yeah, I can see rats getting past that, but they just can all hover. A boulder will keep most animals out, except the rats. Yeah. And moles. Then again, I don't think people use have moles to be a problem to steal their food. Yeah, the meat. Okay, they're, they're working real fast. Let's see, we need one more iron bar. I can see how this can get grindy, but at the very least now, it is it is going at a rapid pace. Yeah! yeah I guess the, if we see the player, if it is, as you said, you, uh, you can only play the single player. Why did they get the well on YouTube? Oh yeah, I might uh, play this myself some other times as well, maybe stream it. Yeah, we could we could stream it a bit more on other uh, something Sundays, and that way yeah. maybe we can discover if this is he actually a hidden gem or if there is a reason why it's not so not so well covered. So I am uh, getting curious. Hey, drop! Oh, come on! At least it's single things. Yeah, I should upgrade my stamina next. <laughs> because that is starting to go down real fast. Two more iron bars. Okay, we have more than enough for that. Nice! Yes. There she is. Workshop, you can instantly create any tools or items that you have to ingredients to make. Okay. Uh, just playing three in stamina so we can move around more. Yes. And all of them and make as many as we can here. Okay. Pick up these. Wait, I think I uh, have a better term of what I'm seeing on my end. Besides it's being pixelated. And that is? More than uh, it's at least. Uh, Shoppy? Could be. Crowbar. Fencing keeps enemies out. Okay. Sign. Torch. Campfire. Okay, we already have a kitchen though. Workbench. Okay, that's... 
anvil, repairs items. Trap. Arrow, bow, iron pick, iron sword. Buckler. Okay, this is quite a few, quite a lot of stuff already. But let's start with something that gives us more stuff and things to make. And it's always good to repair stuff. It, in a survival situation where you try to make yourself uh, as comfortable and survival as possible, would you really need to, to gather uh, ma materials to make a sword? Uh, not really, unless there were other people around. And did that get put into our inventory? Yeah, it, then again, even a spear is enough for that. Okay, so, okay, the workbench is just a, it is literally a portable uh, workshop. Okay. Ah. I Can I pick it back up? No. Okay. At Wait. least we know now. <laughs> Wait, didn't you say it was portable? Yeah, uh, is I, I can put it down and then work from it. But you can't pick it up. Nope. Uh, if I that, that, that's a bit of a bad design. Yep, yeah, I can just carry around an anvil and repair stuff wherever I go. Okay. Wait, what? That, that one does not make sense. Okay. And you can make hamburger. Okay, but we don't have bread, so yeah, tough Wait, luck there then. Hold on. You need two loaves of bread to make a burger. What the hell? I can make a burger with two slices of bread, not two loaves. Thief was caught red-handed. Okay. It's hard enough surviving here without someone stealing our stuff. I might have borrowed a few things, but listen, I will pay you by offering my services. I have connections with many traders on other islands. Traders, there are more survivors out there. Yep, but I'll need five gourd bars to convince them to come here. You're going to charge us when you <laughs> just got stealing. If that was that, this is business. My offer is five gold bars to add this island to the trade routes. Okay. I smell capitalist. Okay, what do we all have here? Two steel bars, a lot of a lot of coal, probably more than we really need. Now, a tree seed, wheat seeds, plants, wheat fields. Okay. Let's see if we can use those. Uh, rest here, of course. First. Yep. And they make the the thief looks like a gypsy. Yeah. Uh, Jay. <laughs> so tell us what you know of other survivors. Most survivors were scattered across different islands, but some of the islands have more survivors, even some work in technology. I've even heard rumors of an island with a in nearly intact ship. Could it still fly? A spaceship? But, well, I did say earlier that if you go far enough with this, you can even go into space. As I said, all I've heard are rumors, but even if it could, it'd be, yeah, as it'd be certain death. Best to stay on this planet. They don't seem to care about us here. So yeah, spaceship. Yeah, and actually I think, I think this is, is in the future, but on another planet even. Since if you just can make a, build a spaceship, you can basically escape. Okay, I see now. We I think we need to have a farmhouse for each of these uh, fields. Yeah, and that the new character have slight beef with her. Is it, or are they, 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 there are how many of her culture in Sweden and all that? Are they not? They are. Yeah, I feel, I feel like too many are depicting them as uh, they naturally thieve, but it's not true. And many of them are tired of it. For apparently, those the people accuse of them of being thieves in every country, and I feel like 
maybe it should stop. Yeah. Let's see. I don't know how tr it does has any. Maybe it's some historic truth that just yeah, you know, got blown out of proportion. Like I mean, there was one caravan that was a bit thievy, then they spit all of them in the same like a double logic like that. Yeah. Well, give me a. Let me take the berry. Uh, have it your way, old man. For now, let's keep go looking for gold. Yeah. I guess I'm just tired of that stereotype. As every time you see a gypsy in a game or movie, they always have to be thieving. Uh, kind of. It's not those stereotypes that are a bit done with. Okay, yeah. Um, the wrong button. I can't. Okay, they don't block my way at the very least. But I should go back to the Iron Sword to deal with these things. Okay, gold seems to be in a lot deeper. And this torch is trying to fail us. So we need a bigger torch. It's, and we have stone here that we can't dig through. Okay. What is this? Quartz, okay. What the heck? What do you use quartz for again? Uh, usually for crystals and such. Or, I meant for or glass and such. Glass. Or okay. Okay, that would make more sense. I was wondering if you if you can turn them into a sort of quartz glass or you know, use them for electronics or something. I think I heard that all crystals that are used for very advanced uh, technology, like computer chips. But I'm sure how true it is. Yeah, I can't say anything on that either. Yeah, I, I, know, it, I know it's true that all crystals that are useful for their uh, tech, but just for computer chips is a bit uh, out there. Uh, for electronics, it's usually um, plastics and metals. Yeah, like gold and copper. And I think uh, that the reason gold is still valuable and we know not as much use for gold anymore is for the gold is so then useful for electronics. Yeah, it's it's conductivity. Uh, I th I think silver uh, conducts electricity better. But I think as a trade-off, it uh, doesn't um, it doesn't last as long than it does. So I think I'm not I don't know for sure. Yeah, I guess the gold lasts longer. Or yeah, gold is rust resistant and all that, yeah, and, and easy to melt down. And no things that you cover in gold like gold, it won't rust. So we have a gold statue or something. It will not there for a damn long time. Okay, what have we here? A phantom or something wear it off. Okay, a hunter. I, I yeah, have to say these anim these animations and such these these are quite nice. Oh yeah, they are nice. And they usually around here the YouTubers stop playing. Like i never seen people get long further uh, the post this guy, really. Okay. Element, element of surprise, from behind you get a critical hit. You have a workbench, you can use it in your inven inventory to make... Okay, so basically if you have a workbench and an anvil with you, you can just build and repair wherever you want. Wait, doesn't he have almost the same haircut as you? Uh... <laughs> Sort of. Hmm. Well, now we have a look for you. Start growing that mustache. <laughs> and what are jobs? Okay, craft a bow and kill some boars. Okay. But what the hell? Oh yeah, him. The only one that does not have a uh, icon, uh, you know, animation guy. Alright, oh, who's upon Wyrm? A Wyrm? A dragon blood? A... Okay, usually Wyrms are a lot bigger. Yeah, uh, 
usually when it's worm, it's usually more like a worm, but when it's a worm, it's more dragon-like. Okay, we can't dig through that either. I can almost bet that the developers may have the, the information mixed up. Yeah. Which, let's be honest, worm and worm and worm are annoyingly similar. These boars are probably going to get, uh, going to start to be annoying. Yeah. But uh, as we've seen, we can just <laughs> go underneath them all and ignore them. Okay. Yeah. And I just remember, I should probably look into if there's any interesting Dutch folklore creatures. I know there's, I know I'm extremely few from there. Yep. Oh come on, <laughs> little scrape. Wait, what? Up here in the corner. Uh, oh, he, I forgot he does have an anime. He, he, that. Uh. Scientist? Okay. It's amazing what you can do when you need to survive. You change, you become someone your old self would barely recognize. Yeah, the new Lara Craft has quite a bit to say about that. Yeah, it, I mean, it is true. A person can kind of change a lot in, the, in, in order to survive. Like, even a lazy person could survive, but if you're still lazy, then you don't have to have, then, then you are truly extremely lazy to begin with. Let's see, if I build this, will it allow me to build a field as well? No, apparently not. Okay. You can just dismantle it, okay. And um, is that the hunter? Uh, the hunter had brown hair, I'm pretty sure. I think that's a merchant. Hmm. Whoever it is, let's just put this wood away. Or maybe okay. it was maybe it would <coughs> spawn the wheat field after wheat it was done. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, at the very least, let's put all of that away. I feel like I remember that dialogue about that guy. For some reason, I feel like I remember him saying that he used to, to be a vegetarian or something. You could dig a tunnel to sneak up on boys and hit them. Yeah, that is the hunter. Okay, right. a bit of a... Yeah, not that. Okay, but what's this here? Dismantle. Dismantle the bars for the. Oh, wait. Oh, I think I know right now why most people stopped recovering around that time. Around this. It was, was, I think it was early access back then. Could very well be. Yeah, then again, why. Yeah, they did see sound a bit uh, skeptical about, about it, that there was something missing, but then again. Mm. I... That might be something uh, thing been be missing. At least me. But then again, not all games uh, work well on YouTube. Yeah. And this has me thinking, maybe we should try Terraria together sometime as well. Yes, I like Terraria, but I don't play it long for some reason. Okay, that and board just came at me with a mission. <laughs> Yes, they have a lot of grudges, but they do look extremely bloodthirsty for boars. Yeah. And yeah, it oh, looks yeah. like I have to need, I have to build a new uh, barn to get wheat seeds. Hmm. There we go. But I was saying, something about Terraria. I like to play it, I don't like to play it long, only for a few days. And every time I play a good player with uh, many people, like you and the uh, headquarters, I somehow usually end up more being, if you like, a burden or just standing around doing almost nothing. Yeah. Well, everyone is springing everywhere and I stand and uh, what should I. Uh, 
Oh, I just don't hear them. Basically like that. Yeah. Uh, let's put this here and see if it lets us build a wheat farm. Yeah. I think there's one thing I do not like about Terraria. And that when you start to make your own house, it won't take long that it won't hear someone else moves into it. Yeah. If he's like, you need to have recruit everyone else before you make your own house. Now you can move them around, actually. Yeah, but it's still annoying for... You always then, oh, no, it's not that you have to that one and that one and that. And I like the houses for the other NPCs, but... Oh, come on. It, it didn't chase anything. Okay, that's... Uh, that's a bad bug. Yeah, I might as well dismantle this one then. Uh, v, dismantle. It costs us some wood, but oh well. But you've got the wheat form back, right? Yeah, the, the wheat is working, but... Actually, I might have... I'll, after this bore, I'll look if an orchard is built separately. Let's see. Like right, you no. need a, a barn for the orchard and a barn for the uh, wheat farm? That was what I was thinking, yeah, but... Yeah. The second barn didn't give us an option to build a new thing. So yeah, that, that seems like a glitch of sorts. Maybe that's why it's not too popular? Why they have not fixed the glitches and all that? I can't say, but could be possible. Yeah, this game is not super new. I think it would be mostly an access to play years ago or something. And that's a kind of thing you would expect them to, to have fixed. True. Again, I have a wife game that you that is like settlers. And I had a very known bug on Steam that they never fixed. That uh, that randomly if you corrupt your save file and you have to restart from fresh. And that is that uh, you can't finish a level without the force turning it off. Yeah, yeah that is just plain awesome. bad design. Yeah, and guess what? They only partially fixed it on the PlayStation 4 one, which I bought. And I didn't know about back then. So yeah, they sold it on PlayStation 4 a year after, or two after they put it on Steam. With the same bug that only happens less often. That's all they did. They only made it happen less often. Yeah, that's just plain uh, stupid. Yeah, it makes me wonder how did that bug get passed to get sold? But well, that's a stupid. Yeah, I think you looked it up online and maybe people were complaining that oh, I never had that bug, but that's so serious that you know. It allowed to pass it to be sold, and to show off, they said, "Never mind, it just can't be me now as well." So yeah, Let's see, I can't say that. Uh, Let me give you my old backpack. It might come in handy when you're out in the field. Okay, and anything new? Like to keep the wildlife in check around here. Could you use the workbench to make me six fences? Okay. Except <laughs> I was actually working at it myself. And, uh, we should probably end this in a bit because we are running on the two hours. But yeah, and I just found the game's name. It's called Valhalla Hills. Okay. I recommend people to not buy it. For I feel like I paid too much for it. Horse can't run through fences, so we can use them to protect our settlements. Yeah, as it is. I think I paid for about it for like 30 or 2 point uh, or 25 euros for it. But for that amount of money, with that severe of a bug, it's way overpriced. Yeah. Okay, let's put this other fence over here. Place. Does he want us to place all of them? Or 
Okay, he doesn't actually want us to place any. Okay. Um, let's see. Nothing new here. So the next quest would be the Oza Worms or the gold. But for now, though, I think we'll call it here. I yeah. I could go on a bit longer because of the breaks with moving the washing machine. But I think we've seen enough of this game for now to know it. So far, at least, it it isn't boring at the very least. It's keeping us busy with quests. But yeah, this this could get boring if the game goes on too long and it gets grindy. But yeah. That's good grind and bad grind. Yeah. Do you think we should stream this sometimes? Uh, not really as a main thing, probably. Just have it as a backup for something Sunday. Yeah, I, I could just uh, give it another shot on the uh, one of the something Sundays. And that way we could easily see how good it is. Well, it is being a good start, but it, yeah, there's something about it. Yeah, it is charming. It, it's, it's obvious that effort has been put into it with the graphics, at, well, at least in the cutscenes. Yeah. And it, it, it doesn't look terrible. It, yeah, it, it is uh, a pixelated and such, but that's by design. It, if, if it's still... Uh, you can still tell all of these characters apart, even if they manage to somehow give the hunter the wrong the wrong hair color. Yeah. Like, he looks more, more like that. Uh, uh, I think yeah, he looks more like oh. a Mentonium Banderas character or something. That's his hood. Wasn't his hood brown as well? Uh, I think it was a bit more gray. It's like a wolfer. Okay, yeah, it does it does match what he's uh, wearing otherwise. So yeah, that that was my mistake then. <laughs> yeah, an easy to make mistake to do. But yeah, the pixelation and animation is just fine. But I will not be surprised if the problem is with bugs. Yeah, it could be. I have yeah, seen a review of this game by Mandalore Gaming, I think. Oh, oh yeah, you yes, have one of them. Uh, I don't remember too much about that, most because that it is a nice game, not great or anything, but yeah, I think next week we'll continue on for an extra hour with this and see what happens then. Yeah, for what I've seen so far is basically as far as people get. Okay, then let's save and return the title. There we go. Alright then, uh, anyone who's been watching now, later on on YouTube, thank you for watching and thank you especially to Akira. Oh, you're welcome! And uh, yeah, uh, in two days we'll be continuing with uh, Legacy of Cain Blood Omen. Uh, but until then, until then. Be safe, folks! Watch out for hamsters!